Absolute monarchies are a bit of a crapshoot. You might get a wonderful ruler like Queen Victoria, or you might get one who's completely out of his mind, like Ivan the Terrible. These nine monarchs had a reputation for madness. Peter III was Emperor of Russia for six months in 1762, and infamous for refusing to consummate his marriage to Princess Sophie in favor of spending every night in bed playing with toy soldiers. King Charles VI of France experienced bouts of psychosis early in his reign in the 1300s. In one famous case, he led an army to track down a would-be assassin but went into a rage during the journey and killed several knights before he was subdued. Otto was elevated to the Bavarian throne to replace his mentally unstable brother in 1886, but was himself declared unfit to rule. After the end of the Franco-Prussian War, Otto would increasingly avoid encounters with strangers and had to be confined to a palace near Munich. Tsar Ivan IV's reign in 1500s Russia was marked by violent paranoia, as the ruler would gruesomely kill anyone he believed was plotting to take his throne, including his own son and heir, Ivan Ivanovich. When Mustafa became Sultan of the Ottoman Empire in 1617, he quickly demonstrated his mental instability by giving important positions to random people he liked such as a man by the side of the road who offered him some water on a hot day. Fyodor, Ivan the Terrible's younger son, was left to become Tsar after his brother's murder. After his only daughter died in 1594 at the age of two, Fyodor took to wandering across Russia, obsessed with ringing all of the church bells in the land. Maria Eleonora became obsessed with providing a male heir to her husband, and became enraged when she finally gave birth to a daughter, Christina, in 1626. She tried multiple times to kill her daughter and became hysterical after her husband's death six years later. King Eric XIV was known for his extreme paranoia. He had an entire family imprisoned and later executed because he believed they were too influential. At one point, he thought he was his own brother and was removed from the throne in 1568. Vlad, the 15th century ruler of Romania, received his nickname due to the joy he got from his favorite form of torture and capital punishment, impalement. He is estimated to have killed between 40 and 100,000 people in his campaign against the Ottomans. In 